Hello, chat. How are you tonight? As we all know, I've wanted to start game streaming again, and what better way than to start with this very serious game that I'm about to play? <laughs> so if you guys don't know what the fuck this is... Um, Neo Kaiser, who you may have seen in my chat often, uh, sent me this fucking game. Uh, Kaiser knows me from back in the dark days, back in the deviant art days, so back like 15 years ago. So I, I've always known he's a bit mischievous. <laughs> and the story behind this fucking game is long, long ago. There was a game called Goodbye Volcano High that was actually a advertised for the PlayStation 5. And it was like an anime furry dinosaur game. Uh, anime furry dinosaur game. Dating sim. And a bunch of 4 chaters got together and said, you know, we could make something better than that. And they made the Snoot game. And then this is kind of related to that, I think. I'm probably butchering it. Hey! Nice, Jerry. See, this is the thing. I was thinking of, uh... I was thinking of doing a lot of my game streams at kind of, like, later times to give other people a chance to come to streams and do gaming streams kind of randomly, I guess, unless I end up doing a long run. Right now, I'm just like, yeah, let's play a shitpost game. This'll be fun. I'll probably have to do reading. Hi, Skrill. You should go to bed. It's, like, 1 a.m. in Poland. Um... What was I gotta say? But yeah, I do wanna- I do wanna stream real games eventually, like... <laughs> I'll probably put up a poll when I'm ready to do, like, a big game stream, because I think I'm kinda going back and forth between, like, either Alan Wake 2, or replaying the Mass Effect Legendary Edition, or what was another one I was thinking of doing? I can't remember. Oh, I wanted to- I kinda wanted to stream Soma again, actually. Because <laughs> I think Soma would be fun with me knowing what's going on and some of the chat not knowing what's going on. That would be fun. Um, but I'm going into this blind. So, um... And I will try to read dialogue in funny voices. Let's go! <laughs> September 4th. Year 201M2023 BC. Okay. Amid the arid heat of the morning sun of the Catadera Bluffs, I can't help but miss living in the more temperate weather of the Midwest. <laughs> Temperate, huh? Summer sleeves are in style this year. That jacket's aroma blog better be right. The suede is killing me. Well, at least it's guaranteed to start getting chillier in a few weeks. Besides, I'm sure to make an impression with this. Abercrombie... Wait, Abercrombie and Flint is all the rage these days. Oh, God. What am I getting myself into? I sigh and lean back on the hard plastic seating of the Metro. I'm on my way to my first day at new school. I'm going to gay school. I hope they don't realize I'm straight. And <laughs> Ordinarily, I'd just be glued to my phone on the trip, but there's just too much on my mind right now. Like all the dinosaur people, you know, those those things. My folks' sitch requires us to move frequently, which gives me little time to fit in. Much like how Rolling Stone gathers no moss, I could never make a friend I'd keep for longer than a year. I don't know why I'm doing this voice, but... <laughs> That's all right. I will keep the VOD up for like a game stream. It's just the weekly art stream that I tend to I tend to just take down week to week because it's just me, just me rambling about nonsense usually. Uh, just a lot of problems. I keep in touch. I petered off within moments. Admittedly, it's my fault in the end, but that's all going to change starting today. I'm going into senior year now. It's my very last chance to prepare for the world ahead. Oh, sweetie, high school won't prepare you for the real world. <laughs> Luckily for me, the cards are stacked in my favor. I feel around my backpack for my DSLR till my fingers can absentmindedly fiddle with the mode dial. St. Hammond High School is extremely well known for their artist curriculum. In other words, I'll be surrounded by people who share my interests, even if it's a bit of a ride away. Speaking of rides, I was hoping that my parents would drive me there today. By the time I was up, though, they had already left for work. Those assholes. No big deal, I like the hustle and bustle of public transportation. God, this guy's such a square. Yes, I'm a 1940s talkie actor. I don't know why, but that's just the voice I'm going with. <laughs> I imagine I'm going to have to get used to this anyway. As time passes, my mind wanders to memories of previous schools. Dot, 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 whatever that thingy is that is our ending punctuation. 
<laughs> Who is this alien? Well, apparently you're supposed to be like the one human among all the scalies, and that's like the joke. They all sucked. Dot, dot, dot. Hey, I need to make the most of the situation I'm in, not get all sad like this. I need to do something like dot, dot, dot. <laughs> oh, the pigeon game, hot the full boyfriend. Take a selfie with the hobo next to me. I won't get stabbed. Get up and breathe that fresh city air. Fresh with many asterisks. Air with many more asterisks. Remain seated and do nothing. I'm gonna take a selfie with the hobo. <laughs> That's no, no even... Oh, I'm interrupted by the ding of the terminal board, and the car gradually starts coming to a stop. You got time, bro? You got time? I step off the metro, heading out to the station as I follow the other students heading toward the school. Oddly enough, I'm the only- I'm only seeing dinosaur students, not another human to be seen anywhere. You know, it's kind of odd. It's kind of odd. Nothing you'd be screaming about if you stumbled into this in real life. Do the dinosaurs live in their own ghetto in the city or something? <laughs> must be one of those dino-heavy regions. This must take place in an Akira Toriyama universe. <laughs> There's lots of greenery here as well. You'd almost forget how close we are to a major city. The next major city is Zootopia. <laughs> the pathway leads to a stone bridge. It goes over a small creek. Okay, we don't need all this. We don't need all this fucking exposition. Sounds of laughter, blah, blah, blah. You're boring me. Get funny again. Ah, there it is. The school peeks out over the trees ahead of me, as though inspecting and welcoming me inside. St. Hammond High, my new home away from home for the next year. I stop to take a deep breath. The air here is crisp, reminding me of old campground. Of an old campground. Of old campground? <laughs> I went back to an elementary school. I, I don't know if this game is a pastiche or if it's actually taking itself seriously drawing with green. It's a little hard to tell. Like, I think Snoot Game started out as a joke and then got kind of serious, so... <laughs> Once again, I'm handed an opportunity to make something of myself. I've failed so many times before. Just so many. I'm apprehensive, but hopeful. It's my last shot at this. There's no going back. What, if you fail senior year of high school, you can't do anything else in life? Really? I take my first step onwards. Here we go again! Aw, oh, shit. Here we go again. That's right, I did have, I did have full animation. Just a, just a faceless dude with sunglasses. <laughs> Students mill about the front yard. The school is known for its heavily prioritized art program. That explains the painting mural on the wall. The first two hours or so, I'm going to go at least two or three hours, Kaiser. But since I'm reading, I might be a little slow. But I'll, I might skip some things here and there to, to keep it a little peppy. I'm not, I'm not the fastest reader in the world. <laughs> Over two-thirds of the graduates end up pursuing a career in the arts. And while half of them regret it from what I've heard, there's still plenty that made it, right? Right? <laughs> also, the manager's claim to fame, with the facade and the front entrance being dominated by a vibrant mural. <laughs> I get a good feeling about this place. Few students eyeball me as I continue walking in. Some friends whisper to each other. Oh no, I'm an outcast already. I just knew my jacket would pay off! Okay, this is a bit of a pastiche. <laughs> yeah, we are, we're just like, we're just like dorky Agent 47 being a high school student. <laughs> Agent 47 needs to assassinate someone here. <laughs> the front doors are propped open and I already feel that cool breeze inviting me in. Inside, it's a familiar yet brand new sight. Dinosaurs, scalies. So does every fucking thing have vines on it? That can't be good for the architecture. I hadn't mentioned it yet, but the school is also unique for its student body. It's composed almost entirely of dinosaurs, all manner of saurian herbivores and otherwise. <laughs> you know what? I gotta say, as much as I make fun of furry shit, I do kind of, I do kind of like the art style of this game. I do, I do kind of low key like it, even though it's like, it's kind of a joke. But you know, it does look good, and I have seen like this game has like full animation in places. <laughs> We're bald and faceless because we're just like we're just like the the main the main character. We're, he's supposed to be a stand-in for us. He's all of us. This is what all of us sound like collectively, <laughs> if we all fused. <laughs> anyway, scales, feathers, tails. Is that a tether? Wings, talons, and webbed hands. Not to mention the colors. 
all vibrant enough to challenge the bright murals of the school outside. I don't know why I'm making him so horny. <laughs> Dozens of students march about, reconnecting with past friends and meeting new ones. At least you guys are the- Wait a minute. Wait a fucking second. Are these two Dexter and Mandark? They are, aren't they? This is Dexter and Mandark. <laughs> I see what you're doing here, furry artist. I see it. <laughs> I know, right? I've spent the last week drawing, like, sexy smiling critters for Cougar. But I did that for money, Skrill. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Alright, I'll be looking out for more references. <laughs> They're Dexter and Mandark's personas, yeah! <laughs> So I'll anxiously, anxiously glance at their schedules, checking every door as though they were numbered at random. Oh, I've had nightmares about school like that. I like I, it's so weird. I, like, like even as a grown ass adult, I've had like school stress dreams. <laughs> I hate them. <laughs> I probably shouldn't be standing here staring. Whoa! Oh, it's somebody else. Whoa! Is that a human? I'm sticking with this voice, no matter what this person looks like. Whoa! -oh. Uh, oh, I'm just, it's just everybody. Soon I'm surrounded and overrun by a crowd of neon-colored teenagers. <laughs> Clearly, my jacket is working like a charm. I am so fucking cool. Wow, he's like a life-size mannequin! <laughs> hey, new kid! Is... Is this what it's like to be popular? <laughs> I really wasn't expecting it to happen this quickly. <laughs> okay, I kind of like this guy. <laughs> I think I chose the right voice. <laughs> a few students are taking pictures with their phones. I even see some with sketchbooks and pens and hands, rapidly scribbling on pages. <laughs> wow, a human! Are you like a foreign exchange student? In the chaos, I feel a few people touch my hands. <laughs> Whoa, human skin feels weird! Okay, this is like... <laughs> this is like going to a completely different country and people being like, Whoa, a white person! <laughs> Jeez, a bit uncalled for! Um... Ask them to back off a bit. No, we're, 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 you know... We want some respect. Oh, it's not that bad. Okay, this game just doesn't actually let me decide anything, does it? <laughs> this, is the, this is the second time it's given me a choice and then completely ignored it. Ha <laughs> He psyched him up, but he's way cooler, obviously. I don't want to be a party pooper. A few more people shout at me to get my attention. Hey, could you look over here for a side profile? Oh, man, yeah, this will be good reference material. You don't have books? You don't have books and photos of humans? Ugh. Wait, wait, I need to get a better look at his skin texture. I once again find myself frozen, only muttering quietly as I hastily try to follow their instructions. <laughs> Eventually, all the Saurians take their photos and talk themselves out before dispersing back to their own friend groups. Yep, I'm boring already. Already, my 15 minutes of fame are over. <laughs> well, maybe I should have been doing Johnny Bravo this whole time. Hey there, Saurian mama. No, I can't do that voice as well. <laughs> By the time I recover from the shock of the situation, the last one breaks off and I find myself seemingly all alone again. Oh. That was my chance to socialize. Dot, dot, dot. My one and only chance. I blew it. <laughs> um, you're human, right? She's just gonna be a valley girl. She looks like one. <laughs> She's supposed to be a triceratops? That is not the first thing I would have thought of. I thought she was a griffin. <laughs> That's right, you need to say they're mostly dinosaurs, though, right? <laughs> <laughs> Damn, I had one shot at socializing, and now it's gone. I can never have friends again. <laughs> the Triceratops girl leans forward, scanning me up and down. Yeah, I should just freak you all out with my valley girl voice. <laughs> this is it. Time to seal the deal and get a new friend! Uh, yeah, yeah! <laughs> Close enough? Hey, can I, like, get a selfie with you? It'd be great for one of my classes. Yeah, definitely. I'm making friends. She puts an arm around my back for a shoulder hug while she poses dramatically in her same art that she was in before. <laughs> Big smile now. 
takes picture and checks it enthusiastically. So, uh, I'm Inco. I'm sure that stands for something. See, if I had a nickel for every piece of meat as a picture of Triceratops as a bitchy mean girl, I've had two nickels. Hey, she's no Sarah. Her name is Sarah. I'm gonna shoot somebody. <laughs> oh, yeah, cool, cool. Yeah, 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 whatever, bro. Bye. <laughs> oh. Friendship is just out of my reach. Once again. What's the photo for, by the way? She pauses, aloofly chewing some gum. My fashion design class. That jacket is ballin'. Ah. Thanks for the pic, hon! Bye! Dot dot dot. Well. I feel my shoulders sag as I now- As I take in the now sparse hallway around me. That must have been my 15 minutes of fame! I just fucking said that! <laughs> I don't think it even lasted 15 minutes. I don't think I could even last 15 minutes with any of these hotties. <laughs> but there's no way I've already blown it. I try to shake away the negative thoughts. Focus on the positive. For a brief moment, I was the talk of the school. For a very, very brief moment. And everyone will have forgotten about it by next week. <laughs> yeah. Click, 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 click. But, uh. The familiar sound draws my attention. I know what that is! It's an old-style camera that probably wouldn't need to make a noise like that. That would be programmed in, but anyway. At the end of the hall, there's someone kneeling. With one of the latest camera models, if I'm not mistaken. Hey! The guy flinches. I flinch, too. I hadn't meant to shout at him, except I am always shouting with this voice I have chosen. <laughs> not that I'm not always shouting anyway. <laughs> we all know how loud I am. <laughs> the few students around me don't bat an eye at it, though. Did I give this guy, like, a nerdy voice? He looks like a nerd. Sorry about the yell. No, it's fine. I managed to get the shot I wanted. The bespectacled boy, I think he's a parasaur, I don't want to be racist, double checks the camera's display and smiles. Yep, perfect. This'll be f a fine print for the yearbook. Can I see? His grin seems to widen at my interest. Of course, here. He turns the display toward me, showing a shot of the hallway, and me as the focal point. Pretty good, right? I look a little closer, and I notice that... I think... It's a little out of focus. Dot dot dot. End dark. What do you have your f-stop set at? Ah, uh, shit. He stops and glances up at me, pleasantly surprised to get a real answer. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm a bit of a photographer myself. <laughs> I'm taking it as an elective, too. With Mr. I can, I can pronounce things. <laughs> Thinking back to my memorized class schedule, the name does sound familiar. Yep. Oh snap! Cool, we'll be classmates. <laughs> Mr. Ilikin's busy, so he just teaches for one period. I'm gonna pronounce that name differently every single fucking time. And yeah, it is kind of impressive that this game does have like full animation for like character intros and shit. So, even though it's like kind of a ship post, they still like put it's like a high effort ship post, which are the best kind. <laughs> it's like a dating sim, but so far I've been railroaded, and I think you're just gonna be going for the gator girl no matter what. I think this is really just like a walking simulator, kind of. Because <laughs> so far I've had two choices, and it didn't actually let me follow through with either of them. <laughs> well, that's kind of funny. Anyway. He offers his hand out for a handshake. I'm Ben. You would be called Ben. Inko. Friend achieved. I'm actually new here, if you couldn't tell by my human skin. Kinda figured, being the only human student this year and all. St. Hammond isn't one of the more popular schools, but the staff put a lot of effort into the arts program. And that keeps coming up. Even the campus itself is designed like a living art piece, so if you ever need help... <laughs> He's, his accent's getting more Minnesota as I go on for some reason. 
Uh, I'm not the best voice actor. My voice is always mutate as I go along. <laughs> uh, for the pause, I'm guessing he's offering some help. I wouldn't say no to a tour. Do I look like a man? Do I look like a man who needs help, Ben? Do I? <laughs> look at me. <laughs> a tour, you say? Well, I'm only going back to the principal's office, but I can point out some neat stuff along the way. <laughs> they can do it, oh, oh gosh. Or make the, the, the main guy do it. Oh gosh. <laughs> he raises an eyebrow to himself in contemplation. <laughs> I could I could turn on voice mod for some things, but I'd have to switch back and forth all the time. That'd be annoying. I'll just do my bad voice acting. <laughs> Might be a good idea to meet the principal, too. He waves for me to follow him. Wouldn't I have met the principal being like the, the weird human transfer student? I don't know. There we go. We're gonna Gumby slide off screen. Dot, dot, dot. Turns out he wasn't just an avid photographer like me. But also the school council president. Oh, am I going to sword fight him? <laughs> and one of his p priorities was taking photos of the school's yearbook for the first day page. Every few minutes we'd pause so Ben could take a couple of shots, mainly the students talking with each other. And while I would watch, I had considered helping him in some way. I mean, that camera looks amazing, and there's all his extra lenses in the bag. <laughs> I feel absolute elation to finally know someone that is into photography. You're both fucking hipsters. Hi, Jaden. I'm playing a silly furry game and, and making funny voices. <laughs> Welcome. This is what I've decided to do tonight. <laughs> and I really want to broach it, but Ben fills the air between us talking more about the school. <clears throat> Which is why we still go by the feather tails, even though I think it's a tad distasteful. <laughs> <laughs> it's a racist. <laughs> Dang, you're pretty good at this. Do you give these tours to all the new students? Nah, not really. Although it is something I've thought about a lot, because I'm a nerd. I'll hold that thought. Hey, Lunanara. Lunara. <laughs> I'm not going to pronounce any fucking thing correctly. <laughs> there's the, Yeah, there's the racism. Maybe calling her a feather tail would be like calling her a mudblood or something. I don't know. <laughs> what the fuck is she supposed to be? One of those Uda, Uda, Uda Tatasauruses? I can't pronounce it either, but I caught one in Ark once. Anyway, Ben goes to greet the student, putting up some intricate wall banners. They're all pretentious art hipsters, it's terrible. Oh, she's a Velociraptor? Now, what kind of voice should she have? I don't know. I'm running out of my stock silly voices. Yeah, let's do a normal voice right now. Oh, hey, Ben! <laughs> I don't know, <laughs> I guess that's what we're going with. You have a good summer vacation? I don't know why I went with Muppet. <laughs> this is what we're going with, I guess. I did. Great work on the decorations. They look even better than last year. Oh, thank you. <laughs> she seems like lots of a valley girl to me, but still kind of maybe, maybe a little uh, ditzy. I don't know. What's all this for? She steps aside so I can fully view the banner she just finished with. The Cultural Arts Club- I've already forgotten the voice I just did. The Cultural Arts Club! We meet every Thursday after school and look at antique artwork. She initially looked past me to talk with Ben, but she gasps once she realizes how hot I am in this jacket. Hey, you're a human, right? Oh, that's a silly question. You should totally join. I just love human culture. There's this amazing set of ancient masks at my place from ancient Europe. I just adore them. Wow, that's impressive. I think you'd make a good curator. And you know what? I probably would. <laughs> After that club display during Spirit Week last year, I gotta agree. We spent weeks studying that tribe and weeks more practicing those dances. Her voice keeps changing. No, don't say she's Lily Orchard. Then I'll have to talk like Ben Shapiro. <laughs> No! <laughs> I swear I'm gonna make I'm gonna make a I swear I'm gonna make like a little jar that you guys can trigger whenever I mention Lily Orchard to shame me. <clears throat> I'm gonna figure out how to do that. Voice reminds you of so, but I don't know. I do all sorts of weird silly voices. No, watch her watch her have gotten like some human cultures completely wrong. <laughs> like wouldn't that be funny? <laughs> We also study and paint with those styles, like we're learning the techniques of the old masters. Watch it be like fucking anime or something. 
Hopefully soon we can even get into sculpting like those old Venus statues. We plan on getting one to look at sometime this year. What do you think? It'd be great if you could come. She's had three different voices now. <laughs> ah, that'd be neat. What do you say, Inko? Hmm. Maybe. I do love culture. <laughs> oh, that's great. Uh, listen, we have this... <laughs> I'm turning British now for some reason. <laughs> we have this old chieftain's dress we've had for ages. We just have to see what it looks like on the real thing. Because all humans are the same, right? All humans have the same culture, right? Like you silly billies. <laughs> uh, I'll, I'll think about it. No way. I'd sooner endure a second impact event than wear something like that. Second impact? Is this is this what happened after third impact and even killing? <laughs> yeah, jar remote. I am gonna do. I am. I am a. Uh, what was I gonna say? I I do have Twitch affiliate now, which I have no idea how it works, but I'm going to figure it out. But I can't upload emotes, so I will probably upload some funny emotes for you guys. If you have any, if you have any requests for chat emotes for followers and subs on on twitch i don't know chat them up tonight <laughs> give me ideas <laughs> yeah right she changes her voice every five minutes because things make up for a lack of personality that's it yeah that's exactly my 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 brilliant um <laughs> my brilliant acting uh choices yes Ugh. Well, hey, nice to check up, Lunara. We've got places to be. Take care. Thank you for the follow, by the way. <laughs> Bye. I'm a Southern Belle now. <laughs> I should do a Southern accent for one character just to differentiate them. She waves us off, and Ben continues leading me to the principal's office. Oh. I'll give you a voice when I see what you look like. Hey, Ben. <laughs> Oh, hey, Michael. Listen, can't talk now, but I'd love to catch up later. Yeah. I'm floored. This guy seems to know just about everyone in school as much as they know him. Talk about being on top of things. He's the school council president, though. It's kind of to be expected. I do have a few Spinel emotes. I mean, I have some emotes from my Discord. Uh, but... I can I, I have to make I have to make things square for Twitch, so I might as well just make brand new emotes. <laughs> anyway. He points out a few more landmarks in the school and stops to greet a number of students happy to see him after the summer break. Man, sorry for having to stop so much. No way, I think it's cool you know everyone. If only it could be cool without making us late. <laughs> and we both went ha 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 ha. He points out a few more minor landmarks in the school, eventually leading me to its biggest draw. A very poorly drawn hallway. Amazing. <laughs> I should have talked. This is about as good as my backgrounds get. <laughs> I already knew this place was known for art, but wow. They hang up everybody's drawings on the walls like a mom hanging up drawings on the fridge. <laughs> Just outside the administrative offices, the hallway is filled with wonderful pieces of work. Paintings that line the walls with name placards beneath detailing who the artists were. All created by alumni and attending students of the school. And this is the gala. All the pieces have been featured in all kinds of articles and presentations. Whoa. I know, right? One moment. Ben turns to the nearest door and gives it a polite knock. Who is it? I don't know. It's me, Principal Scaler. An overraptor, no older than her mid-thirties, exits the room. Holding a steaming mug and sporting a tired smile. I'm just a little thrown off to see what she looks like. No, oh, okay, she's kind of normal. I guess I should do like a mature woman voice for her. I, I'm, I am a mature woman who does not have a mature voice. <laughs> Good morning, Benjamin. No, that'll be fine. Get my Kerbet in a Kerbopple. Oh my god, she's dressed again in a Kerbopple, isn't she? Good morning. <laughs> Inko, this is our esteemed principal. Good morning, ma'am! <laughs> her eyes shoot wide, wide, mid-sip of her coffee. It always takes them a second to realize the bald motherfucker behind the other guy is a fucking human. Oh, I hadn't noticed. You would be Mr. Gunito, yes? Inko Gunito? No. Oh, that's... That's our name, guys. <laughs> that's our name. <laughs> 
<laughs> Incognito, the human. <laughs> God fucking damn it. Hi, Ryan, and this is a game called I Want to Hug That Gator, where you are a, a simple boy uh, who is at his first day of dinosaur school, <laughs> where he is the only human. That's all the explanation you're getting. <laughs> And his name is Inko Godnito, and I am for that. <laughs> God fucking damn it. <laughs> uh, and I'm doing this voice for him, by the way. Yes, but my name. Did she pronounce it wrong? How wonderful. God is the exhaustion on her face, instead replaced with a very wide smile. Oh no, I'm going to be a token, a token human guy for the school's <laughs> diversity program. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I'm so happy that you've chosen our school for your last year, Mr. Nitu. Oh, is she just gonna mispronounce my name like every time? It's actually a running gag I really like in things is when a character just constantly says another character's name wrong. <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> ben, be sure to give him a thorough St. Hadman welcome, okay? Well, he has been. Unless a thorough welcome, uh, you know, involves something else, you know. Uh, <laughs> wherever he was. Not a diversity hire, diversity uh, student transfer. If you ever need any assistance, my office is always open, Mr. Netu. <laughs> yeah, she's got to pronounce, mispronounce it every single time. Well, how is it pronounced? Not to mention, the student council is also available for help. I'm basically just using my phone voice and customer service voice right now. <laughs> if you all want to be a little freaked out. Isn't that right, Ben? Y yes, Principal Scaler. Thank you, Principal Scaler. <laughs> oh, and Ben, a moment, please. But is she his mom. Is this why he's so uncomfortable and mad at her, or something else going on here? Have we already come to Saint Hammond? Fuck! I just got it. Hammond from goddamn Jurassic Park. <laughs> <laughs> what is this game? <laughs> the main character of the shoot game is named Anan E. Mush. Of course he is. <laughs> this is a game made by Channers. If that gives you any any context to what we're witnessing before us right now. She's a cat or mug though, so I guess mammals exist. Well, I guess mammals must exist because a human does, but you know, you know what I mean. Anyway, I'm interrupting the story. The Parasaur is dragged to the office, leaving me alone in the school gala. I don't even have my schedule. I have no idea where I need to be. <laughs> Whatever they're saying, I can't hear over the ambient noise of the student body. Either way, it's probably not something I meant to hear. <laughs> I move a few feet away out of earshot of the discussion inside. I'm being a polite boy. On the wall beside me is a framed panoramic landscape of the city painted by hand. Wow. It's not very good. <laughs> So mean! <laughs> dot dot dot! Wow! I could practically use this thing as a map with how detailed it is. This would suck as a map! Where- how would this help you navigate? <laughs> Inco! <laughs> no wonder it's hanging so predominantly in the principal's- by the principal's office. The gentle brush strokes that totally aren't digital. <laughs> the vibrant colors that definitely aren't digital. <laughs> The evening sun bouncing off each of the windows and the majestic scarlet sky enveloping the horizon. All of which combine together to give it a dreamscape feeling that, like it's an idealized version of the city. Well, yeah, it's a piece of art. Of course it does. Looks like Bob Dylan's paintings. I, 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 I'm gonna guess that's not a compliment. <laughs> it's dot 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 beautiful. I've never seen a big ad I've never been a big admirer of paintings, but I can't deny that this is a masterpiece. It, uh... Sure is. Sure doesn't look like it took somebody like 10 minutes to do it in fucking Clip Studio, but okay. It sure does look like a sketch that was unfinished. <laughs> yes, this, this totally must be, you know, delicate watercolor. Uh, on, on, like, you know, recycled parchment paper or something. Whoops. <laughs> oh, I... Oh, I just right-clicked by accident. Actually, let's save, though. That's probably a good idea. How do I... How do I get out of this? Okay. Press S H to hide the text box? Why would I want to do that? <laughs> Why would I want to hide this amazing dialogue? 
<laughs> Only a teacher could have been able to express the scenic beauty of the city with the this level of skill and passion. Is it you say so? I withdraw my Cavone Stone 60 from my back. <laughs> with the compact lens, I keep barely fit in the entire I can barely fit the entirety of the painting in the frame for this shot. I can read. Checking the copy on my display, I realize I left out the, the title and artist of the piece. The tag says, Dreamscape, artist, O. Halford, ninth grade. Dot, 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 first place, 201 M2020. A freshman did this. Jeez, a freshman did this blobby sketch of a city. My god, I will never be successful. <laughs> <laughs> Credit to this game, at least they actually show the things they're describing. That's true, drawing with green. <laughs> now that I look at the rest of the paintings, this is insane! It's all so much better than what I've made. <laughs> Almost all of the pieces are beautifully drawn. I draw like a, a chimp <laughs> with missing fingers <laughs> in my own poop. <laughs> Probably. <clears throat> Acrylic, charcoal, pastel, none of which uh, any of these are because it's all digital. <laughs> and yet, not even one photo. This is gonna be- this is gonna be our footloose plot. Nobody likes photography, it's- it's- it's, it's forbidden by the school. This is- this is gonna- it's not gonna be racism, it's going to be, I don't know, art classism, <laughs> I guess. Hey, Inko, I'm back. My mommy yelled at me. I'm a senior. How on earth am I meant to even start measuring up here? I might as well throw myself out of a window right now. <clears throat> Inko, you, you look like you're having an existential crisis. What is that annoying noise? It sounds like Ben's voice. Oh, okay, never mind. Ben nudges me back with the back of his hand as the commotion gets closer. Hey, watch, jackass. Go, oh, you roll, labor face. My leg. I watch as the, er, uh, perpetrator, aggressor, aggregator, finally rounds the corner and comes barreling down the hallway. Oh, is this, is this best girl? Is this, ah, I gotta stop. I gotta stop right clicking. <laughs> is this gonna be our, is this gonna be our girl that we want to hug? <laughs> it's speeding straight for, towards us. My insects kick in and I stumble into the side to avoid the oncoming collision. For just a split second, I get a good look at my assailant. Oh, it's full animation again. Like, good on them, you know? There's our culprit. Green scales, messy hair, and a faded purple hoodie. She propels herself forward with a dexterous hand, spinning the large wheels on her dot dot dot. I only now notice she's in a wheelchair. I didn't even know you could go that fast in one of those. Would you think she was running that fast? <laughs> why does Ben look like a scaly Jaden from Yu-Gi-Oh! GX? I, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why anything is anything in this game. She glances my way. Her pupils lock onto mine. Just the pupils, not our irises. Only the pupils. Her gray and gold eyes are marred by bags like she hasn't slept in days. She looks like she hasn't taken a bath or brushed her hair. She's so beautiful. <laughs> The girl's entire presence is ghost-like. And that expression, dot dot dot, it's like she's looking straight through me. I love women who stare into my soul and have nothing but contempt for me. <laughs> I'm sure she barely registers my existence, but I don't think I'll ever forget that face. That angry, insomniac, leathered, <laughs> dirty face that hasn't bathed. Uh... Just as fast as she came, however. Oh, we don't get a- we don't get a- we don't get a fancy animation for her leaving? Oh well. She's gone. As she leaves, I feel like a weight is lifted from my shoulders. Dot dot dot. At least until I trip directly into a glass case behind me, because I am Inko. <laughs> I am Inko, protagonist extraordinaire! <laughs> Oof. Hey, watch it. Whoops! The Parasaur's hand roves over to display carefully. Care, care, care. I'm having a stroke in the middle of my fender. 
<laughs> His eyes filled with worry. You looking for something? Cracks. Usually when another student falls into them, there's some kind of crack or scratch. Guess it's just a dino thing. You humans are lucky you don't gotta sweat over this kind of stuff. You know, like, <laughs> you're all really squishy <laughs> and soft and useless. That happened often? Often I'd have to drain school funds and repairs. Okay, I'm starting to think he really is the principal's son, though, if he's this worried about that sort of thing. I know this game is kind of a parody, but the fact the MC falls for an average looking girl makes me think Tumblr would love her. Yeah, right? Although I think that was the whole point of these games, where they were gonna do, like, Tumblr games better than Tumblr. Like, actually make them, like, you know, decent. I mean, obviously the game's very tongue-in-cheek, but it, it's kind of, you know, it's winking and nudging at us. Like, hey, you know, we're all, we're all, we're all here to have fun today, you know? Alright. That can't be good! Well, not to, not to brag, but I make do. A vibrato charm uh, echoes through the now empty hall. I freeze, tardy, on the first day! But I play Validate? Oh god, do I even want to know what that is? That sounds like another parody game. <laughs> ah, whoops. Sorry to run on, sorry to run on like that. You should get going to your first class. Won't, need to, won't I need a tardy slip or something? Nah, it's the first day. Teachers are lenient. I'm, I'm fine either way, since, you know. Ah, one of the benefits of being class prez. Definitely not the principal's child. <laughs> Definitely not what he is. I know what Danganronpa is, kinda. Danganronpa, it's another one of those, like, battle school things. <laughs> I don't care about anime that takes place in high school. As I'm playing this. <laughs> this is a dinosaur high school though, it's very different. We're, yeah, we're playing the, the not snoot game, that's still kinda snoot game. Yes, because um because Kaiser sent it to me and now I'm now I'm streaming it. Cause that's how that works. <laughs> Usually if somebody buys me a game, I'll stream it for them. Anyway, what's your first period? Have you had your first period yet in college? Very important to know. <laughs> Physical education. Who has, who has gym as first period ever? <laughs> ben sucks the air through his teeth in a prolonged wince. Uh oh, is the is the coach racist against humans? <laughs> dot dot dot. Dot dot dot. Mm, you'll be fine. Gymnasium's down that away. Don't, uh, keep him waiting too long. I need to get going, too. Unless his dad's also the gym teacher. <laughs> keep who waiting? Gotta go, bye! <laughs> and bye! Oh, he walks fast when he has somewhere to be. <laughs> somewhere far, far away from me. <laughs> dot, 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 that reaction doesn't exactly instill confidence in me. Oh, he's very, he's very observant. I'm gonna keep saying dot 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 because I think it's funny. Dot dot dot! <laughs> I follow Ben's directions toward the school gymnasium. After all the earlier commotion, it's the first quiet moment to myself. Might as well take it to finally sort my thoughts. Let's see, what do I think of... think of this place so far? It's certainly livelier than any other schools I've been to. Ever since I've stepped foot in here, everything has been so lively and everyone seems so... exuberant! It makes me feel a little out of my depth, since I'm so used to the opposite. Here are people like that girl earlier are eager to share their hobbies almost without being prompted. <laughs> Everywhere else I've been, people have just kept to themselves, like they're only there because they have to be. Dinosaur school gets me. It hits me. This school's art program attracts people. The students here don't have to be here. They're choosing to be here. That's why it's so active. Well, all right, what can I do with this information? <laughs> if it means I can probably be friends with anyone I want, right? I... I don't know if that's how it works, Inko, our, our, our himbo... our himbo protagonist man, but okay. I will make a friend by the end of the year! At least one! <laughs> Where to say, but with everyone here sort of working with each other, there's bound to be an insane level of camaraderie too. Maybe I won't even have to try. <laughs> I, al 
I'm almost at the gymnasium now, though, so I'll hold that thought for later. Am I about to be assaulted by the racist uh, coach or something? That's what I was saying. All the plants on the ceiling can't be good for the architecture. Dot, dot, dot. Ah, gym class, where the boys are separated from the men and where people with Heruclean physiques are able to show off their sculpted bodies. I don't think that's what gym in high school is about or like, but maybe I guess in visual novels, yeah, it is. Anyway, <laughs> dot, dot, dot. I begin to remember how much I dreaded going to PE. <laughs> the innumerable bad experiences from past schools pale in comparison to many skidded knees and broken glasses. Hopefully, this school's PE is a lot less grueling. So he never takes off his sunglasses is what he's telling us. <laughs> he never. <laughs> I broke so many sunglasses during dodgeball that year. <laughs> Oh, oh wow, this one is just, this one is just a photograph put through a Photoshop filter. Come on, guys, you couldn't have, like, painted over it a little bit. <laughs> this is just a filter photograph, fuck you. <laughs> <clears throat> As I said before the wooden double doors leading into the gym, I'm struck with how empty the area looks. Maybe I'm in the wrong place. That's followed by me catching the sound of physical activity coming from within the gym itself. Shoot, I really am light. Ben's earlier warning echoes in my head like a foreboding spirit. I peer through the small windows on the doors and see students standing shoulder to shoulder. Towering over them is a primate who I can only guess is our gym teacher. <laughs> With his arms crossed and a skull on his face. Well, there's something kind of like a human here. I'm just gonna save real quick. <laughs> I hope I can get away with being tardy. I'm gonna imagine no. Hello! I am new! <laughs> um, hi! Uh, oh dear! My first thought is how lucky I am to be alive. I don't even know what was thrown at me, but it might as well have been a cannonball. I spot the gym teacher, and even though his baseball cap- Even through his baseball cap, I can feel his stare of rage pierce my soul. Such intensity. And that ideal throwing form. I only miss- It only missed my centimeters. Ah! I have to stop right-clicking. <laughs> that was a warning shot. <laughs> Look at this dude! Look at this dude! <laughs> No, this no well, son! I have a policy! Each of my platoons gets one free miss from me a year! And you just spin it! Is he? I'm trying to do like Arlie Ermy, but this is like the best I can do. <laughs> I shift my eyes to the students lined up next to him, and they're so stiff with fear that I can't tell what they're feeling. You got three seconds to lay down in front of your squadron! Why in the great name of Cave and Dawkin are you late? Well, I, uh, I'm a dumb human boy, sir. He, he didn't even move. Head taken. I shut my mouth. The Simeon Scholar starts marching back and forth like a drill sergeant. Yes, yeah, so that's the vibe I'm getting. Listen up, because I'm only saying this once. In this class, we operate on tough love. We learn from our mistakes, so you better pray to Raptor Jesus that you don't forget them. Fucking <laughs> damn it. <laughs> <laughs> because if you do, with three monstrous steps, the coach has closed the distance of ten yards to tower over me. I will be very upset. It reflects poorly upon all of us, and that is not something I will accept. I would love to see you, Megan, succeed. If you don't, I'll make it unforgettable. <laughs> Thank you for the hundred bits for my terrible voice acting. Am I understood? <laughs> Fucking Raptor Jesus. <laughs> he would have been, yeah. I nod my head in fear. Bad Frank fantastic Now then, draw the rest of your ranks and stiff it up! Yeah, I think we all had a gym teacher like that who thought he was like big shit, even though he was like a fucking high school gym teacher. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck he's training. But once I confirm my bladder is intact, I shuffle over to where my colleagues stand. You mean your classmates? I mean, colleagues. There was always a self-important coach like that. Come on. Anyway. I feel them staring at me with anger, like I'm responsible for the coach's teaching style. 
What an appalling first impression to make. I should just quit and start over somewhere else where I can when I still can. <laughs> hey, thank you for the gifted subs. Oh my god. I'm gonna have to make some uh, sub benefits now. <laughs> Thank you so much! And, on, and for this, and for this wonderful game that we're playing, it, it's, it's marvelous. It, it's art. <clears throat> I think you guys can, uh... Oh yeah, one of you's got a sub, okay. I, I am so bad at how the Twitch stuff works. <laughs> anyway. <coughs> The teacher takes a second glance over us, reminding himself where he was before I had interrupted. Not to do this fucking voice again. Latin hunt maggots! You will drop and give me 20 of the finest push-ups! Those guts best be an ant's fart off the prestige gym floor around! <laughs> Twee! <laughs> With a violently loud blow of his whistle, the coach takes his position to show the proper technique. Oh, he's gonna do push-ups at us to show how... <laughs> show how tough he is. I hide my wince as my knees impact roughly on the ground. The real pain starts as I try to keep pace with everyone around me. Yeah, that would be kind of unfair, wouldn't it? <laughs> my biceps and forearms threaten to splinter from the weight of my body and the speed of my jerky movements. I never realized just how badly out of shape I was. <whistles> on your feet, you bop battle slugs! Ah uh ha! -huh, this guy, he ain't human. Well, yeah, some kind of primate, maybe a, a close relative. <laughs> Hang on, I just got a work text. Someone best not be calling me in tonight. I swear to God. Okay. 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 Oh, it's our it's our new hire. I was like, I was like, why are you sending me the the owner's phone number? I have it, but they have the same name. <laughs> anyway. I can feel my muscles hollering in pure agony as I force myself up from the gymnasium floor. By the time I'm back on my feet, my breathing is heavy and coming out in whistles. <laughs> I can't whistle. Now then, since only the first day of school, how about we have ourselves a good old game of dodgeball? D did he say dodgeball? Oh, do I have do I have PTSD from dodgeball? Do we have PTSD, everybody? We're collectively inco, everybody. So me, you, everyone here. Anyway. Oh yeah, dodgeball time! Who the fuck are you? <laughs> I shoot a glitch on the overly enthusiastic dinosaur next to me who is absolutely elated by the prospect of the upcoming game. We only finished the warm-ups and my muscles are already screaming! My knees shake, my lungs burn, and I'm so drenched in sweat that I'm sure I might need a shower after this. You usually shower after gym class, you gross bastard. <laughs> I really don't want to play dodgeball! <laughs> Aren't we lucky? It's the first day of school. We get to play a game. I'm just gonna keep going with this voice. <laughs> uh, I, I don't, I don't do dodgeball. Why not? I, uh, I'm not exactly. All right, maggots, pick a side and keep the numbers even. This is a suicide match. <laughs> and a free for all too. <laughs> He's just also gonna have a southern accent, I don't care. <laughs> Damien, why don't you socialize by picking your teammates? Change, you're on the blue team! Wait, but why are there teams if it's a free-for-all? Alright, I'm going with the human dude. Before I can figure out the rules for this dodgeball game, the Dilophosaurus wraps an arm around my neck, my neck, and brings me to this side of the field. <laughs> Oh, one last thing. I didn't know it was the coach because he wasn't screaming. <laughs> His leer and tone frees me to the spot. What's the first rule? We only got one. Have f f fun. <laughs> dot, dot, dot. Gang up on the weakest one. Wait. Huh? <laughs> In a matter of seconds, the gymnasium is a flow blown, flow blown battleground. I do my best to dodge oncoming flurry of red rubber spheres coming away by my way like bullets. I can't even talk, I'm so flustered. I dive to the ground, avoiding the oncoming projectiles as they soar overhead and pelt my comrades. 
I hear the blows and the guttural groans of those who've already succumbed to the <laughs> onslaught of inflated oil. <laughs> Damn it, I hit fucking right click again. I need to like just move my finger away. What is this music in the background? <laughs> <laughs> anyway, combat crawling away from the fierce front, I entrench myself along the edge of the field in hopes of being ignored. I cast my gaze to the rest of my allies and, oh god, it's a full round, so many bodies! How's the first day of school treating you, bro? <laughs> He's just gonna have this voice for you. <laughs> Dodge straight! I look up to see the Finn Dino, the same pink Dilephosaurus who had dragged me to his side of the court, staring down at me and smiling. What do you think? I watch as he casually dodges an oncoming ball before throwing his own. Name's Damien, by the way. Uh, Inko! Nice to meet you. You two! Chrome Dome and Frills! <laughs> Who said you two had time to talk? Does my gymnasium look like a debate stage? I mean, maybe if we got some of those stands from the auditorium. <laughs> I know a guy's uncle that could make a really classy podium. I think I picked the right voice for this guy. <laughs> I look up at Damien with absolute bewilderment. What is this guy thinking? The coach looks like he's about to explode. <laughs> Do not play smart with me, son. Keep your trap shut and your eyes focus on the anime. <laughs> Damien just smiles and gives the coach a thumbs up as if we are to the middle of an active war zone. I got it, Mr. Solly. That's Coach Sally to you! And that what's the hold up change? You're just making yourself an easy target on the floor! <laughs> yeah! I am pro but I'm not exactly good at dodgeball. Dot dot dot. Oh, maybe I can do the whole blocking thing for everyone. I'll just make myself a fucking meat shield. <laughs> and that'll be worthwhile. <laughs> that should hopefully make it so everyone isn't peeved at me for wasting the warning shot! But here's the whole, here's where things change. I can totally turn this around. All is equal on the court. <laughs> the okay, ball aimlessly rolls on the floor in front of me, calling out to be my ammunition. I somehow weave through two shots at me and pick up the ball. Oh yeah, I'm feeling it now. <laughs> I'm on fire. There's no way I'm losing now. I grab onto the ball and start blocking any shot that so much as crosses our side of the field. Yeah, I'm doing great! Block one, block two, block it. I bet everyone's looking at me now. <laughs> I bet I'm accidentally scoring points for the for the opposing team, aren't I? I bet you anything. Uh, sorry about the ads. <laughs> I, I set them up on Twitch. I mean, come on, guys. I, I do like to make money. <laughs> anyway. Uh, any thought of playing the game suddenly left my mind like it was never there. The fuck OBS. OBS just fucked out on me for a second. Am I still alive? How's the connection, everybody, if you can still hear me? trying to fix my stream. 